cardstock equipment. Was this one similar? I mean, uh, you know, we're a few years removed now. Uh, what model a did few. you use? <laughs> I'm trying to make a mold. I apologize. I'm sorry. No, um, I use exactly this model. Um, the you know trapeze fast back and all my fingers in. Never stick anything out. And basically, you know, it's 12 and three quarters, and it's it's pretty much the same model they've been making for years. The gloves that I played with, I played with it for 17 years in the big leagues, and I, I still have that glove. And I oil it, grease it up, and it's not cracking. So wait, wait. Yes. You used the same glove? For 17 years in the big leagues. Oh my goodness. Yes, I just got it patched up and, and taken care of. And of course I got a backup, which is 16 years, right. but um, pretty much they make a great leather. The other thing I did that was you know peculiar that I never allow anyone to put their hands in my glove. So so look at this, and it's funny you saying that. He's so respecting the glove right there. A lot of you will grab a glove, and folks will grab a glove. Try yeah. it like this. Yeah. You're being very respectful to oh, me. Oh, yeah. yeah. But me, as you can see, my hand, I always hang my hand out because I want to be able to use my fingers. Right. Of course, I close from thumb to pinky. Right. That's the best way to keep the ball in the glove. How did you take care of it? Obviously, you said you had it patched by the very best. Yeah. But what, what sort of uh, advice do you have for those that want to care for their glove? Well, um, I don't want to give that away. <laughs> no, but I'll I, I tell you guys on camera, I, I use saddle soap. Okay. I use saddle soap and I only did it at the end of the year. Okay. And basically I leave a ball in it at all times.